Hi everybody and welcome to my Vuelta a España stage 6 prediction. For reference, here's the GC going into stage 6, with Jumbo Visma deciding it was time not to defend the red jersey and to share some of the spoils after having made the point in stage 4 that Roglic is in top 4. On stage 5, we saw a massive performance from Marc Soler. In the green jersey competition, Sam Bennett and Mats Pedersen remain up front, while in the Polkadot competition, Victor Langalotti is doing some great business for Burgos PH. After the start in the Netherlands and two tough medium mountain stages in the Basque Country, stage 6 is the first proper mountain stage, comprising a second category climb in the first half of the stage and two first category climbs in the final 40k. First, with roughly 40k to go, we get the Colada de Brenes, nearly 7k at 8.2% average, and the stage finishes atop the Ascension al Pico Nano, a 12.6 km climb at 6.5% average. Note that this average is deceiving though, because the climb kicks off quite steeply, flattens out in kilometers 7 and 8, and then picks up again in the final 4k. If a team wants and dares to drop a bomb at the start of the climb, we could see some fireworks here. This should really suit Evenepoel, the question is whether they will dare to go for it after Roglic's impressive performance on stage 4, and with the team not proving super strong. That being said, and even though it may be too early in the Vuelta for the top favourites to go for it, I'm expecting a GC win on this stage. Here's the stage odds at the time of recording, with Roglic a massive favourite. For my top 10 picks, I'm going mainly with GC men, who've proven to be alert and who seem to be firing on all pistons. Evenepoel at Quickstep, Roglic and Kuss at Jumbo Visma, Hindley and Kelderman at Bora Hansgro, and Sivakov at Ineos Grenadiers. Hendrik Mas at Movistar and Ben O'Connor at AG2R. And given there's still a chance that the break makes it, I'm picking Jay Vine at Alpesin and Alexei Lutsenko from Astana. In terms of stars, Evenepoel and Roglic get 4 stars, Kelderman and Kuss get 3 stars, Sivakov, Hindley, Mas and Lutsenko get 2 stars, Ben O'Connor and Jay Vine each get 1 star. In terms of podium prediction for this stage of the 77th Vuelta a España, I'm going with a win by Evenepoel, followed by Roglic and Kelderman. Thanks for watching, leave your thoughts in the comments below, like and subscribe, and see you again soon. I'll be trying to drop some predictions for the weekend.